bright duty every student matters hello dear students welcome to another lecture and in this lecture we are going to begin with another writing skills topic which is posters now posters among all is the topic wherein you get a chance to showcase your creativity and your artistic skills in the maximum possible manner now poster is a useful means to make an announcement so it is not only a way of uh, you know for you to use your pen and your colors and everything but making a poster is uh, you know very very important because of the reason behind it the objective of writing of making a poster so if you wish to make some announcement if you wish to make some appeal if you wish to create awareness among the public make a poster for that they are used the posters are used by the political parties the religious organizations the event organizers advertisement agencies ngos government departments like the public relations department health and family welfare and so on so all these valuable all these reputed organizations make use of the posters because making a poster is one of the most creative way of expressing of bringing forth something very very important to the society now what are the objectives of making a poster what are the things which need to be kept in mind before making a poster so a poster is always prepared to keep in mind a specific target audience so when you make a poster you have to keep in mind that there is a target audience that you have there is an audience that uh, you have made the poster for and keeping that target audience in mind is very important it is one of the most powerful means of publicity so through a poster you can actually publicize a lot advertisement of an event public awareness related to current problems and needs all these things are taken care of with the help of posters posters convey important messages most effectively so in the most effective manner a poster can convey the most important message also it can take the form of an invitation to uh, events such as fairs carnivals fashion shows sales exhibitions cultural programs fetes and so on so when you make a poster for any such event such as you know some fair or exhibition or fete or carnival then the posters can actually take a form of an invitation as well now what are the things to be kept in mind when making a poster it should be very very attractive visually so when you look at it you should find it very attractive the heading or the title of the poster should be very catchy you should use slogans or short short verses short short poems in order to make your message clearer to the public you have to use clauses you know short sentences are to be used by you you have to make sketches also when making a poster and if you are not very good at drawing you can even make the matchstick figures what do we mean by matchstick figures these are the matchstick figures that we learned you know when we were kids the language that you use when making a poster should be very persuasive persuasive means very convincing so with the help of your poster whatever message you wish to give to the reader should be loud and clear and the reader should be convinced about the message you are conveying the theme should be clear so your theme of the poster should also be clear to everyone the word limit of making a poster is again only 50 words and one should not exceed that the tense form generally used is either present tense or the future tense the name of the issuing authority or organizer is a must 
so whosoever is making the poster whosoever is issuing the poster writing the name of that authority at the end is very important now what are the tips for making good posters first posters are used to give information on students activities and social issues so you have to make sure that when you are making a poster on some event then your activity social issues are being highlighted to it you have to make a poster in a rectangular box we have to use a wide variety of fonts you know so a lot of fonts are to be used by you when making a poster we have to use very catchy very attractive words very attractive phrases and slogans when making a poster we uh, can say that a poster is like a notice but align the phrases at the center when we write a notice there is a proper format you must have seen my video that i recorded on notice writing and you saw that writing a notice had a proper format the content had to be written and you know at the end the close again but when we talk of a poster in case of a poster everything is aligned in the center so whatever you write whatever you draw is always aligned in the center use your creativity draw simple pictures but do not waste time on them so the organizer's name can either be written on the top or at the bottom of every poster we have to use an asterisk we all know this is an asterisk so we have to use an asterisk if you wish to add any important information using small boxes of different shapes to highlight a detail so if you are making a poster if you are making different different shapes and you are writing something in these boxes then again it makes your poster look very attractive and the poster should look neat and graceful so just because you are drawing you are sketching you are using colors does not mean that you are going to make your poster look dirty your poster should be very neat and it should be very graceful as well so what are the different types of posters that we usually have we have posters that are used for publicity we have posters that are used for the awareness of some social issue you know um, women empowerment pollution corruption population these are all the social issues so we can actually make posters in order to make the uh, people aware of them and again publicity is something that i've already told so these are a few samples of the poster this is about a blood donation so donate blood your blood can save life in these boxes you can see some information is given then here also some important things have been stated and at the end comes you know the name of the organizer or the issuer then this is about the equal rights so you see how beautifully this poster has been made equal and then for rights every sort of person has been drawn from aged to young to one who is not physical who's, uh, who's physically disabled so every kind of person has been shown in the picture in order to talk about the rights and then it has uh, a beautiful quote at the end that all human beings are born free and equal and who said this this was issued by the universal declaration of human rights in the year 1948 similarly you have this poster for non smoking so a rectangular poster do not smoke smoking is injurious to health you can see in small uh, square box they've shown the picture of a cigarette and then they've written stop smoking then in these boxes every cigarette cuts your life short by 5 minutes save your precious life 
say no to cigarettes because it brings ruin and death. So everything important has conveyed has been conveyed through this poster. And at the end, like I told you, it is important to write the name of the issuing authority or the organization. And this is issued by the Ministry of Health. So, you see dear students, this is how we make a poster. It is very simple, very easy to make a poster. You only need to be very smart with respect to the pencil that you use when sketching or drawing and also the slogans and the verses that you use. And if you are good at it, I am sure it will be very scoring for you. So, my dear students, I hope this topic was clear to you. I shall see you all now in my next lecture.